right, welcome back everybody to Farming Simulator 22 here on uh, Western Wilds your host with not the most Mr. Blue aka Tommy Miller folks look out across there at the rocks there's so many rocks oh but anyway as you can see behind us here this sticking thing just in case y'all new to the farm sim thing, this is a soil sample. You see these trays right down there? Two of them's got soils in them and the other one's empty. So we've been taking samples. And, uh, let's see, press B to bid. Oh, on that bidding thing on the land, we got a couple, of, about six hours and one day left on it. Anyway, yeah, I'm going to switch to this view. And you can see our mini map right there. We got some rusty looking colors. And, um, yeah. I want to try pull four. You can see right there, it might not get it all the way. We're going to try it right there. Take sample. See if I can get it. Yeah, I didn't quite get it. I'll get it on the next one. Oh, 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 this is so rough. Oh, that's rough, folks, going across these. All right, that probably would get it about right there, maybe. All right. Go over this way. You probably can see it better. Pushes that strobe down in there. You can see it going down barely, coming back up. And then, uh, yeah, just keeps uh, taking dirt from it and stuff. And we go into our big map here. It's getting late, but tomorrow going to be September 2nd. We're going to probably try to plant wheat instead of canola uh, in both fields. Maybe. Um, maybe one field wheat and one field canola. I, I really don't know yet, but anyway, we go, um, September 2nd, it's supposed to be rain, but anyway, yeah, I forgot what I was thinking about there, folks, sorry about that, go about right there, do this again, look right in this area right here I think you can see my mouse you'll see this thing come down yeah right here take a sample see there tray moves over that little thing right there is going down and it's back up and voila we got a soil sample and I've done done 44 of them so yeah oh can't move there we go I couldn't move the tractor because of the mouse And you just keep on going back and forth and try to get your best best coverage you think you can get since it's a circle. Take one here by the edge of the road. We got that much there to do. And folks, I'm gonna finish this and bring you back on the next thing because basically all we got. Oh crap there we go while that's doing that let's go back into our actual you can see right there what we got left yeah got this little strip there already done this strip here and yeah so I will bring you back when I get a uh, last sample and then we'll send them off to the lab all right, taking the last sample. Little bitty tiny dot here that I missed, so that's all of them. I'll show you the map one more time. This one's showing 50, the bottom end on the score. And this one's 42. All together, we got 46. So, um, uh, hold soil sample in it, lower soil sample, take soil sample, send soil samples for it. I'm an animal, 
analyze them and stuff. So that's going to be why. Soil samples are now sent to the laboratory for uh, to get analyzed. You will see the results on the soil types map soon. Okay. And you're probably like, Mr. Blue, your money's halfway gone. Fix and show that to y'all folks. Um, did we release this thing? I can't remember we released it. Let's see here. Oh, release items. Okay. Oh, yeah. I bought the soil sample, so it's mine. Good. We're going to fold it up and we're going to take it back to the farm shop. We're going to get this bad boy here cultivating our fields and some other stuff. So we'll be right back. Alright, I'm going to put this thing under the shed here. $8,250 for soil samples. Ooh, doggy. That's high. Alright, drop it off right there. I'm going to take this bad boy and see what it do with it. Oh, it's on the other side over here. Alright, you probably see the the rock picker there. And like, why are you not talking about it, Mr. Blue? Oh, give me time, folks. Give me time. Give me time. Oh, there's one more thing we got to do. I'm fixing to mess up again. Go ahead and shoot this bad boy off. We lease the rock picker. Uh, Scorpio XL. Um, yeah, this is lease. It's extra big. Um, right here, you can see there's no rocks. pH value is very bad. Nitrogen. Uh, it's, it's perfect right there, but you go over here, it's not. So, but you see how thick the rocks are. Here's where the rock picker went. And then right here is where I started cultivating again. And the cultivator was pulling some more smaller rocks back out. So, what I'm going to do, uh, this has already got, I think it's bad because, well, let's go in here. Let's look. Oh, wow. Salty clay. And loam on that, and, and this one's got loom, sandy loom, and loomy sand. Okay, that's still 50. Um, I'm pretty sure they need. See that? Now it's been fertilized. This one hasn't probably could do one fertilization on it maybe and uh, nitrogen Let's see pH I can't remember which one's which I think nitrogen is fertilized and pH is the lime don't hold that to me if I'm wrong put it down in the comments but anyway I gotta go show you something else real quick so I'll meet you up at the dealership um, Guess I'll be walking. I can't remember where I put my truck. All right, I'm gived out, folks. I'm so gived out, but I made it down here. Um, yeah. Oh, everything's over here. This is what I bought right here. Yeah. Well, uh huh. Um, look at this, folks. What y'all think about this tractor? Oh my god, it's so pretty. Okay, okay, okay. That's where my money went. Um, 238k for this whole setup, folks. $238,000. Um, the load, loader arm was like 10k, and then the uh, thing here was like 2,000. And the tractor itself was uh, 227000 somewhere in there. So, yeah. Um, 
we'll get in this tractor real quick and I know this is not what we need on the front but it's part of the package so I'm like I'll take it now we're going to have to go in here oh my pass it right here we need some lime folks lime right there um, I don't know eight they give it eight okay three thousand six hundred for that yes we're buying and now we're gonna go into fertilized spreaders is one we got don't spread lime okay yep 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 going over all right which one do we have uh this one right here is one we got so we can probably get about twenty thousand out of it maybe i want a carry oh they got got some big stuff in here twenty thousand twenty five thousand nineteen thousand and it does lime and fertilize I wish some of these would do seeds like this bad boy here oh it does do seeds it does fertilize lime seeds uh, whatever that hand thing is and then oil seed radish Man, I wish we had the money to get that thing. I'm going to show you what it attaches to here in a minute, but we got to buy this for right now. We got to start small. It, it does lime fertilize. Um, ooh, 24. 25. Uh, we'll, we'll stick with 24. Uh, we can leave a brand on there. Capacity. Um... 15,000 right there. We're going to go with the 15,000 liters because we're going to be doing lime. Uh, ticker, ticker. Oh, what's the part on the back? Okay. Little blue things right up in there. Um, We're going to buy it. Oh, so, yes. That's where the money's been going. Everything but the rock picker has been bought, folks. And this tractor's got a GPS thing on the front. Oh man, I didn't get one with the... That's just great. Must have some sensors on my mirrors. I bet I got the wrong tractor. Anyway, we're going to do some lime real quick. It's 1800 at night. That's what? 6 p.m. And it's getting dark. I just want to go ahead and fill this up. And I will meet y'all at the fields, folks. Be right back. All right, folks. Look at this coverage we got. Oh, my goodness. Uh, we're putting out 7.88. Something other there. Or on auto. But pH value is lime. And we can go in here real quick and show you. You can see right there where we've been. We got all that to do and this over here to do. So we gotta get rocking. And we're gonna save some time because we got GPS. Yeah, GPS folks. Whoa, hit the wrong lever. All right, get out of the trees and turn on, see? right at the max you see that little blue line over kind of I know you can see that oh oh doggy that's fast all right what I'm gonna do here get over here and set my GPS again since there's a little bit a little bit right there and that's just all and uh, page up, oh, nope, page down. Get that scooted over. While that's scooting over, we'll leave that running, keep the air going. Uh, this guy here is on a 
the color painter and we done fertilized and lime this so now we are going to oh I need a weight in front of this maybe the worker can handle it oh I don't know a tractor can handle it I'm pulling hard But that's what we want. We want to. Man, look at the dust that's kicking up. Yeah, I know I don't have access. The weight's right down here, so I'm going to go get it. Should be right here. Yep. Whoa. See if I can nudge it around a little bit. There we go. Um, oh no, I don't want the weight blowing down. I want the, uh, the color bearer. Max working speed's 21 mile an hour, but I don't think this is going to pull it that fast. Now, I do have the new dust mod. I don't think this tractor is going to be able to handle this thing. It's making a lot of dust. Looks good and pretty behind it. There are still some rocks. I'm just going to hire a worker. No field found. What? Oh, man. Alright, we're coming back to that. I'm gonna shut this off, shut the lights off. Uh, I guess go down this way. But yeah, folks, uh, sorry about that one little clip there with the AC running, because, you know, it's um, about 10 30 in the morning. I'm recording this, and it's hot. Man, it's hot already. So I, that's why I had the air on. And I forgot to turn it off. I'm like, oh man. But you look in the top left corner up there, it shows us our pH value. And 613 tons to hectare, 526. So, yeah, it's about valuable rate. Whew. I don't think we're going to have enough. Definitely won't have enough for the other field, so we're probably going to have to buy some more. I don't want to buy too much, so I think I'm going to get a trailer. Um, yeah, get one of the trailers, get my truck, and go buy some more and take it to the other field. I should have enough to finish this, hopefully. I'm just going to get maybe four this time. Depending on how this is going to run out. Yeah, I kind of hit that. I was hoping it would pull off. and Y'all you know, see I didn't hit it. But it's all good, right? Mr. Blue always hitting stuff. Alright, here we go. I'm going over a little bit, but it'll be alright. Yeah, it's going to be close. If we have enough for this field or not. But as you can see, it's turning everything green behind us, so that should be good. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes. 397 liters left, folks. Uh, I am going to, whoa, take and drop these, this uh, pitchfork thing off. And uh, go get some more lime, and I will see y'all here in a second for y'all. A little bit for me. All right, folks, we're down here. What was it field 27? Yeah, field 27. And we are filling up with lime. It's kind of hard to see it, but it's lime. You just have to trust me. 
and uh, this little truck can't handle the shoulder loaded. That's about all it could handle. Probably gonna have to get out and scoot some of these closer back up or something. Wait, how did it take that in the way back there? Okay, maybe I don't have to back up. It, it's slow about feeling, but it, it's it's doing. But folks, I don't know when the next episode is going to be. I really don't know when this one's coming out. Uh, you know, I got a video that I need to post. kind of like a vlog slash uh, trip to St. Louis. I need to edit and get done. And, um, yeah. So, uh, you'll see this one first. And then I'll, I'll hopefully have the Udden ready after this and it's just a lot of pictures I got placed in order and stuff because took some on my phone took some with uh, my Nikon D6500 or whatever it's called I can't remember oh I'm full okay all right let's get down here get everything set up and show you what I'm gonna be doing after this I'm gonna uh, put uh, fertilizer on it and after the fertilizing I'm going to do the cultivate, cultiv cultivate it make it smoother and um, uh -oh. oh I'm on the tractor that's why uh, no it's alt C yep there, there's my lines okay Got to move my lines over. Um, other way, other way. Come on, come on. There we go. I'm gonna overlap that right there just to make sure. Get straight on this line here, and that should about do. It. Ooh, don't hit the tree. And we are lime. We're putting lime down, folks. Good, it covered everything. All right. Probably could have went around that tree, but you know what? We're in a hurry. Cause it's supposed to rain sometime tomorrow, and we got the cloud symbol. You know what comes after clouds? That's right, rain, liquid sunshine. Well, we'll probably need it, but I would love to get the crops in before it rained. If not, these fields will be ready for soybeans or something if we don't make it in time. There we go. No one, no one hit no trees. All right, this is what I'm going to do. Make a trip down pass here. That way I don't have to worry about going into the tree line, which will be coming down. We'll make our ditch uh, or field out to that ditch and we should be good to go. But that's what we'll do in the winter time. And now I'm just worried about getting some crops in the ground. Oh man, I wouldn't lose a little spot there. Be alright. But folks, let me get this done. I'm going to uh, bring you back in the morning. And then we'll end the episode after that. Be right back. All right, folks. I'm sorry about the background noise if you hear a fan, but it's getting hot, so yeah, I'm fixing to wrap this up. It is 22:11. That is what 10 o'clock, 11 minutes after 10. Well, we got four things of lime here left, and three things of fertilize. And uh, yeah, it's, it's dark out here. Got everything off the trailer. I got the, our new fertilized thing under there. Um, we got this field here, rock pick. It held everything in it. Um, so yeah, you can see pH values even with 7,000. Nitrogen is 145. I guess that's good. We'll go in here. Of course, it's going to save. You can see here we got the field done. And over here we got a through. 
Now when we went down through here, turn around and you see about right there where it gets narrow, where I stopped and I parked it over here because uh, I don't have nowhere to dump them and uh, I think about dumping them right in here, I don't know. But we go to growth, uh, blue is cultivated. I guess it shows that being cultivated with the rock picker, so that's good. Uh, go down, make sure, yeah, cultivated. Okay, good. And go back on up. Um, got stones. Oh, oh, I gotta go up one more. Here's the soil, and here's the pH value. See that field up there is pretty good. This in here might need another dose down at the south of the road there. And uh, yeah, the nitrogen doing pretty good. So having to say all that, let's go down to weather. Um, September, it's going to rain around 2, 2, 2 a.m. And then September 2nd shows rain. So, but anyway, 2200 here, so here it's midnight. We won't get no rain today, but first thing in the morning, about 2 a.m. I wish it would show, uh, I don't know what this is, maybe a wind speed or something. But yeah, we gotta get some wheat in ground tomorrow. Um, got John looking for a planter. I, I heard he found one, so I'm hoping that will be the case. Oh, I hope it ain't be a case. I'm just saying I hope it be the case that he finds one. Um, but yeah, all this here is done. Uh, sheep are asleep, some of them. And uh, yeah, so that's going to be it, folks. Uh, and next episode, if it ain't raining all day, we'll be planting. So I hope y'all have a great one. I appreciate all the comments and the love and support y'all been giving me. It's been awesome. But uh, got to get out of here. Got to get go in here, get some sleep. Speaking of, let's go ahead and go to bed. We're going to wake up at, let's try 6 o'clock. Ding dong, ding dong, ding dong, ding dong, ding dong. There's rain. Didn't last very long. Uh, Clifford is the highest bidder with 30,000. Okay. Um, I want to show y'all that again. Uh, I don't know how many hours is left. But the dude's trying to bid me. Alright, uh, as you can see, going across all these fields, it's not popping up. When I get in this field, this is a, to place bid 31,550 ends in less than 18 hours. So hopefully next episode. Oh yeah, I gotta bring the rock picker over here. Here's where, where it's over here. It's full. Here's where we got the rocks from. Here's the rocks. So yeah, but everything looking good. So um, what was I going to do? I was going to fast forward time, but. Uh, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's go to the 7 o'clock real quick. Almost there. Alright. Back down to about 5. Yeah. 5 times the speed. I'm going to place a bid. Uh, farm 1 is the highest bidder with 31. So, uh, why is it euros? It's supposed to be dollars. I'm going to place another bid. I see 32,718. There, 33,886. Let's see if that happens to be anything. And folks, I will see y'all in the next episode. I love each and every one of y'all. Again, thanks for all the comments and love. And uh, I'll try to catch up to them as soon as I can. And uh, yeah, y'all have a great day, a blessed day. And I'll see you in the next episode. Bye.